Alrighty y'all, today we are making an LOL bracelet, like it literally says right here, couldn't find it, literally says LOL with a little smiley face at the end. So, that's what I'm going to show you, and it is, it's 36, it's 36 steps, but um, most of them are really like the same. It's not very difficult, I should say. And it's a one two one two pattern, so on the even rows we are going to take out the first and last string. And just so uh you know for setting up purposes, it's going to be um you're gonna have your word color, which is mine, blue once again, and then your background color, which is white for me. And it's gonna be a, and that's really, it's gonna be like blue, white, blue, white, blue, white, blue, white. Um, there you go. Blue, white, blue, white. And that is, uh, that's gonna be 10, let me see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, yep. It should be about, ten, it should be 10 strands total. Six, eight, ten, yep, ten strands total. There you go. So, for the first row, we're doing backward forward knots across the entire row. Backward, forward. Backward, forward. And if you've seen some of my videos, you know I'm not the fastest at making bracelets. But patience is key. <laughs> and all these directions are going to be in the description bar below. So you don't necessarily have to follow along with this video. If it's easier for you to just look at directions instead. And that's kind of the way I like to do this. But it could just be me. Okay. Alright, row two. You're taking the first and last strings out because it is an even row. And I'll mark in the written directions if you look at them, I marked the even rows with a little asterisk, like a little star, so that way you remember. On this, you are um, doing backward four knots again across the entire row. So, um,. I kind of forgot to tell you, but, uh, you know, uh, yeah, so just back and forth. And this is going to be your, the word, like the start of the L, um, LOL. And the color that I'm, I have is blue for that. So, yeah. Row three, brought those two strings down, and we are doing backward forward knots across the um, entire row again. Like I told you, see, it's pretty, it's a pretty simple design here. I mean, it's not too hard. Um, if you don't know the basic knots, one, you should stop right now and check out my knot tutorial video because if you don't know them you can't do these kind of bracelets because this bracelet is only backward forward or forward backward knots the entire way so if you do not know them you will be confused and I'm sorry for that but you will be that is why I made a video for it it's pretty pretty nice to have kind of knowledge before going into the bracelet making thing. Yeah. Alright. Row four. Bring the first and last strings up. As such. And you're gonna start with a backward forward knot. Okay? Take your word color. 
should be the second. Backward. Forward. And then you'll be doing uh, three, four backward knots. So the first one was just to help start get that um, little thing on the L, like the little L part um, out. So help with the L. Just so you know, I also have another channel, Smart and Small. It's where I make music videos. They are so fun, and I hope that you guys enjoy them because I love making them. I just put a new one up not that long ago too. It was pretty pretty good. Hi. Right. Now we're on row five. Hi. Right. Now we're on row five. And you brought those two strings down. And doing backward forward knots across the entire row again. So you it's this is it's pretty dang simple, to be honest with you. I mean it's really the difficulty level of this is not very um Hard. And that's really cool because if you just started out and you want a cool bracelet that says LOL with a smiley face on it, um, it's not gonna be it's not gonna be difficult and you'll be able to do it. Cause I I mean I could I could do this when I first started out too, and I bet you could as well. I have faith in you guys. Ooh. Yeah, so other, the bracelets that I uh, really are, that I'm trying to make here are ones with like pictures and writing and stuff. I just find those awesome. Like seriously, they're amazing to me. So, I make those. And uh, ones I've made so far are the Deathly Hallow sign, which I uploaded and uploading. And then I also made, a, um, I also made a peace sign one that was colorful and stuff and it was really cool and I loved it. <laughs> anyway, row six now. So these two strings, the first and the last one, back up again. Don't use them. And we're doing a backward forward knot to start it out with. Make sure to get these knots nice and tight so that the words don't look like a big jumbled mess because you never want that. And then we're going to do three forward backward knots. Ooh, sorry about that. Gotta remember to watch out for the computer. Yeah, I did 70 inches for the long strands, you know. And I think that that's enough, personally. I'd rather have more than less, you know. Because if you're in the middle of a pattern, then you run out. Anyway, but row seven brought those two strings down. Doing backward forward knots across the entire thing. Again, see? Pretty simple. Forward. Sorry about that. Okay. Kinda reminds me of like an embroidery thing, you know, like when you see those messages on a pillow. Kinda what it reminds me of right now. I wish I had one of those. I don't have any of those. Hey, if you guys have any of those, put them in the comments below and I'll see what they say. Kinda cool. I wish, uh, at least I knew how to make those. Okay, roll it. Uh, bring the two strings up. Do, 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 do. And we're doing, uh, four backward knots across the entire row. Wow, my foot is really asleep. <laughs> Don't you just hate that when your foot's asleep? It's horrible. Can't even move it. It feels weird. Anyway. Alright, forward, backward. Don't worry guys, I'm trucking through. I won't leave you hanging. Okay, forward. Backward, and then the last. 
last one. Okay. Okay. Row nine. Brought the two strings down. Doing a backward forward knot to start her out. Now we're gonna get on that O. So we're doing three forward backward knots. You now when I first saw this brace, it made me laugh out loud. <laughs> Woo! The jokester. Anyway, uh, just remember, make those knots tight. Don't want loosey goosey knots. Remind you of that in every single video, I believe. Because you never really, really want them. You know, they're not your best friend. Alright. And then a backward four knot for the last two strings. Because remember, these strings are acting as pairs, you know? Okay. Row 10. First and last strings are back up. And we are doing here we are going to be doing a backward forward knot two forward backward knots And then a backward forward knot to help with those sides of the O. Alright, row 11. Doing backward forward knots across the entire uh, row. I, you know what my goal is? In these videos, I hope to teach you something, but then keep you entertained. Because there's nothing worse than watching a tutorial video that's not fun to watch at all. Like, if you're just like, Okay, now we're going to take this string and do a forward knot, and then I'm going to bore you. No, you don't want to watch those. I want you to watch these, and also, you know... You'll be entertained. You'll be like, hey, she's got a new video. This bracelet looks awesome. I want it. But she's also really fun to listen to, so I'd rather watch this. You know what I mean? You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? Alright. Row 12, first and last strings up. Alright. We're doing a backward forward knot. Start her out. And then we're doing um, two forward backward knots. Hi, another forward backward knot here for the second one. And then end in with another backward forward knot. Okay. Roll 13. 